Let's explore. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Wollongong. Wollongong. And we are celebrating because we're out of lockdown. We sure are. <laughs> and how have you celebrated today, Phil, with something you haven't done for probably longer than lockdown? Got a coffee. <laughs> Yeah, I was a bit shocked when he came back from the cafe with three coffees. We're, we're actually staying with friends and we're just going to show you beautiful Wollongong. We're going to have a look at the, the boat harbour and the waterfront. Stick around till the end. There could be some awesome drone cliff shots, we're hoping. This is Wollongong Boat Harbour, a great place to have some morning tea, just hang out, lots of seating and picnic areas and of course the boats. Coming in from the north is some rain filled clouds so we're actually running to try and get as much as we can done, get done today or this morning we hopefully will be able to come back out this afternoon. If you've watched any of our videos you know that I um, do find it a bit important to pinpoint any memorials and here's one right here. This is the lighthouse at Wollongong Harbour. This is between City Beach and North Beach and the Boat Harbour, sitting out on the peninsula. And this is the steelworks. They were winding it down, but they're now not. And we're looking at City Beach in Wollongong and the city behind. Life Saving Club at Wollongong at City Beach. There's lots of parklands and just open green space around the beachfront at Wollongong that you really can't help but want to just chill for a bit. Over the road we've got the entertainment centre and behind there those tiered seats are Wynn Stadium, home to St George Illawarra Dragons which is the rugby league team that I used to support when I was younger. Chico's, if you're looking for something to eat and you're in the centre of Wollongong, Chico's is a great place to go. We had dinner there last night, it was really cheap. It was about $10, $10 a head. And Phil, what did you have and what did you think? Uh, New York style chicken schnitzel with chips and uh, mushroom gravy and that was beautiful. With the rain coming in, as you can see, it was pouring. We headed out with our friends to a local cafe called Tally Ho's for lunch. After enjoying another reasonably priced meal, we parted ways. The boys went their way and Kaz and I went shopping. <laughs> but that was not before we checked out the interesting artwork in the Crown Street Mall. Raining and there's definitely more people in the Crown Street Mall than there was when we went in for lunch.
For dinner, we decided to go to Samara's, a lovely Lebanese and Mediterranean restaurant. Peaches! <laughs> Our amazing meal consisted of two platters that we shared, the Lebanese platter and the Beirut platter served with a side of pita bread. Today the sun is shining so we're going to try and go back down the beach and get some more brighter vision. Every good football stadium needs a football leagues club. Such a better day than yesterday. We've stopped to pick up lunch at Ostermere Beach. Uh, this is a place that I used to frequent lots as a little girl. Great little swimming beach about uh, 10 k's north of Wollongong and just a really lovely place to uh, sit and have a swim and have a picnic and all of that. We're actually going to eat at a different beach to show you but this this is Ostomy Beach. Oh, you call me back. Yeah, I know that. Yeah, I know that. Though the travel in Shell's Diner have been around for years. You're far away and yet so close. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, you're up in space. You're inside the noise. I can feel you. Mm. Once you've seen all the things. All the places I hope it means that you'll come home to me once you travel the world, all the spaces inside your heart. even halfway along the sea cliff bridge or, or sea cliff bridge uh, you can walk the whole length but it is really cold getting really windy and Phil's taken a drone up so I'm gonna head back to where we've parked the car to catch up with him I hope you've enjoyed 
a little visit on this bugger bit of coastline. Feel the traveling kind, it's a known fact. Yeah, I know that. joining us on our Wollongong trip. If you've got questions or you want to know more, put it in the comments below. If you enjoyed our video today, why not hit the like button? Hit that subscribe button and ring that little bell and you'll be notified of our upcoming videos. As always, thanks for joining us. Travel, Travel brilliantly. brilliantly. Bye. Bye. If you liked what you saw today and you want to see more, check out the playlist above or find us on social.